Farmers continue to struggle and still no movement from Congress on updating the farm bill, which is now more than five years old. 12 News reporter Brock Wilson was in downtown Wichita today where agriculture leaders talked about the future of the ag industry. It's new at 6. Kansas agriculture leaders are in a closed door meeting about the ag economy in the U.S. Kansas Agriculture Secretary Mike Beam and former U.S. Agriculture Secretary Dan Glickman talk about some of Kansas farmers' biggest concerns, including the lack of a new farm bill. They'll extend it to early next year. Former U.S. Ag Secretary Dan Glickman has little worry about the status of the farm bill. I don't think anybody will be really, truly jeopardized by not having a farm bill because we will have a farm bill. It will be the extension of the current farm bill. But agriculture leaders in Kansas say having an updated farm bill is a top priority. Our congressional delegation is uh, as concerned and maybe as frustrated as anybody. Kansas Ag Secretary Mike Beam says he wants it reauthorized as soon as possible. Each day that we go without getting it uh, reauthorized is, is of a concern to, to a lot of people, including farmers and ranchers. The current farm bill was authorized back in 2018, and a lot has changed changed since then. There's growing concern about inflation, drought, and how subsidies are paid out. Cost is a chief concern for those in Congress. We have a very large budget deficit. It's gigantic. Officials say it could be next year before any changes are made. As soon as we know what it looks like, uh, it just provides more certainty. In Wichita, Brock Wilson, 12 News. The federal government estimates a new farm bill would cost about one and a half trillion dollars over 10 years. It's unclear how close Congress is to agreeing on that number.